Right, so I've already done an unboxing on this. I've done a Christmas special. And I'll uh, stick a link up there so you can click on it in case you want to watch it. But we will do a quick uh, unboxing just so you can see what I'm getting. And then we're going to do the installation. And I'm hoping that I can just unplug the old one, this baby here, and just plug this in and everything should line up. But it probably won't work like that, but that's what I'm hoping for. So with that, come over here and we we'll do the unboxing. All right, let's have a look. See what you're going to get for your money. Nicely packed by El Gato. Uh, Stream Deck, this would be your basic information. Download and install the Stream Deck app software, which we've already got installed. So like I said, it'd be interesting to see if it will just plug straight in. I don't need to learn how to configure it because I know how to do it and it's really easy. But been waiting to do this for quite a while so that's the main body under there should be some leads here somewhere there you go we will need that i will change the leads uh and i don't know oh important safety instructions i won't be reading that i know they're important but i'm not going to read it okay and i don't think there's anything else in there so some information on the Back. It says it's for Mac and Windows. We only use Windows here, so I'll leave them out for now. Put this out of the way. Let's have a look at the baby. This was a Christmas present for my wife. So I've done a Christmas special on an unboxing. Yeah, it looks really cool. It's magnetic, apparently. Oh, there you go. You can feel it, you can feel the magnet inside. Yeah, pretty good. So, El Gato symbol there. It's owned by Corsa, I believe, now. Uh, yeah, it looks really good. Right, with that, we're uh, going to do the installation. Oh, right, we'll have a quick look around. Oh, don't break it, don't break it. So, like I say, it's magnetic. It just comes apart. Cable management there, so that's really good. Good idea. Got the model number on the back, made in Taiwan. Lovely feel with them buttons. I do like them buttons. Feel really nice. Excellent quality. Just hope she works. And that's it. Like, do the unboxing now. Right, I think the best way to do it is to turn it all off. That's what I'm going to do right now. I'm going to shut the baby down. Probably don't need to do this, but I'm just going to do it as a precaution. So that's the old one all disconnected. And I'm going to quickly pull it away until it's back in its box. Right, it says it just works. Pretty interesting. Comes up with the El Gato logo, which is cool. Look at it 32 keys. Oh, it's asked me to copy the profile across. Copy, yes, copy the probe. Ah, oh, brilliant, it worked. So, all you have to do, so all I had to do, it comes up with a suggestion would you like to copy the profile across? I said yes, it's done. So, all I've got to do now is move it all about and, suit, and set it up to suit me. That's really cool. So, we have the clock, uh, my Streamlabs OBS is in here, and all my bits are there. So, I have a couple of layers. So, what I can do is set everything for my live streaming now, I can set everything to one layer rather than have them on all different layers. So like I say, this so for instance, this is my main page. So this would be my main page. And this would be for my live streaming page. And obviously you can do layers on layers on layers on layers. So 
come closer, we will have a little mess about. Let's see that. You really need to see the screen more than you need to see the actual device itself. So it's everything is should be down here. Yeah, so that's how it's all set up. So when I click on this, this takes me all into my live stuff. Um, but what I want to do now is move all that out and I will put that on the next page back. So I'll lay it all out here. So all my live stuff, I'm going to move right down to the bottom. Right, so that was it. So that was really easy. It took me a little bit of time to sort out all the keys, all the new layout, because obviously I've got to have a lot more keys on each one. So when I do my live stream now, I just go into here and I've got me different scenes down the bottom here. So if I want to change scenes, like I'll go, go into your away room, I'll just press one of the buttons. Oh, so I just press one. <laughs> I've got my sound effects all across there as well and some messages I've got that can pop up. Plus, if I need to go into more layers, I've set it up so I've got more layers, so you can go into there and I've got a couple of effects down there at the moment. I'll go back, so yeah, it was easy. So we're ready to rock and roll in my new 32 key stream deck. And the crowd love it. So uh, that's it for this, uh, I don't know, little presentation, little unboxing installation it was really easy i had to make sure i took off the shiny bit of plastic underneath so it's a bit more grippier because you know you don't want to keep pressing it and it starts moving away from me do you so i took that off there's a bit of film underneath I, I thought it was under there but i wasn't sure and every time i press a button it kept moving away so i removed that so that's all done yeah very happy looking forward to doing my next live stream so with that, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give me a thumbs down and uh, please subscribe. Oh, and I'll stick a link in the video description in case you want to buy one.